the forehead of your robot. If you were a child, and you watched Spongebob in 2008 to 2011, or watched videos on YouTube of people talking about the worst Spongebob episodes that they have seen, you might be aware of a Spongebob episode called, How's Fancy? It is known as one of the more infamous Squidward torture porns out there, because of the infamous scene, where not only does Spongebob rip Squidward's toenail off with a couch, but there's also a scene where Spongebob was looking inside of Squidward's window, and admitting that he was spying on Squidward, and then Squidward's house blew up near the end of the episode. Granted, the host of the TV show that Squidward was watching, Nick Withers liked Squidward's house, but did you know that there was originally going to be an alternate ending, where Squidward's house was actually hated by Nick, and Squidward was made a laughing stock on national television? How do I know about this, you may ask? Well I was browsing on a random website, that I used to watch cartoons to marathon some Spongebob episodes, to make a top 20 worst episode list on my YouTube channel, for Spongebob's 20th anniversary. This was until I realized that How's Fancy is the next episode on the list to watch. The last episode I watched was the episode Stanley S. Squarepants, which was pretty forgettable and boring, but it's not on my worst episodes list. However, I consider the next episode House Fancy to be one of the worst episodes of the show, because of the same reason everyone else hates this episode. I was not really looking forward to revisiting this episode again, but maybe I could warm up on the episode, or I could hate the episode even further. So when I clicked on the episode, the video immediately played, without loading or having an advertisement, like the website usually does. I found it very jarring, but I just shrugged it off as either the website not having an ad to play, since it does do that sometimes, or my Wi-Fi might have felt extra fast today. But what I didn't shrug off was the fact that the title card had different sounding music it usually did. Instead of the normal soundtrack from the episode playing, a short version of the house fancy theme played. Other than that, most of the episode was normal. That was until the episode got to the near end. Once the episode got to the near end, Spongebob blows up the vacuum cleaner, which in return blows up Squidward's house. Once Squidward's house blows up, Nick Withers and Squilliam Fancy Son came over to see Squidward's house, which is now blown into smithereens. Now in the normal version of the episode, Nick Withers claims that Squidward's house is a masterpiece, and he was to be crowned, fanciest house of the year, which as a result caused Squilliam to break down crying. However in this version, that's not what happened. Instead Nick Withers and Squilliam both laugh in Squidward's face. Then Nick Withers says to Squidward, that if there was an award for, world's ugliest house, that he would win first prize and explain that he's not going to go outside without being laughed at. Then the host looks into the camera to tell the viewers to laugh at Squidward, and his house every time they see him in public. Then, it shows a scene that really made my blood boil. It was a montage of every viewer in Bikini Bottom that was watching, laughing at Squidward. However, the laughter was not like the normal comedic laughter that you would usually hear in a normal Spongebob episode. Instead, it sounds like it had a lot more malice and hatred towards Squidward, and the way his house looked. Then, it cuts back to Squidward, looking like he's on the verge of tears, being berated by Squilliam again on national television, just like at the beginning of the episode. Ha! See? You'll never be as fancy and wealthy like I am. Enjoy being laughed at by the public for eternity, cashier boy. Squilliam said, as he spits on Squidward. Squidward just went into a fetal position and just cries. SpongeBob's reaction to Squidward crying was what angered me even further. Instead of apologizing to Squidward for causing the house to blow up, or trying to make up for what he did, he said, it's okay Squidward, you can sleep at my place until you get your house fixed. Hey, we could be roommates together, and I could also help with redecorating too. This in result, causes Squidward to cry even harder, as the episode ends. After that episode, I got pretty angry. So mad, that I actually put my fist through my computer screen in a blind fit of rage, since this video made me hate House Fancy even more. I suffer from bipolar disorder by the way. After realizing what I did, I decided to drive to the mall and replace it.
It's an old computer, so the warranty is out of date. When I got home, I tried to load up the website, but unfortunately, I couldn't remember the name of the website off the top of my head. I tried searching up all of the websites, where you can watch cartoons online, to search up How's Fancy, but only the current one shows. So if you know what I am describing with this post, please let me know.